Hey, welcome to today's video. I'm Leslie. If you're new here, welcome to A Charming Abode. So as you saw by the title of the video, I'm going to show you 10 things that you could totally live without. But here on my channel, I never try and get you to buy a bunch of crazy things, but I want you to think of me today as a friend who's showing you some really cool items that you might find interesting or helpful with this upcoming holiday season for yourself as gifts. I love to see what other people that I trust recommend and I bought several things that way and so I was like, you know what, I have some really fun items and I want to bring them and show them to you. So don't take this video too seriously and get hung up on the materialistic factor of buying items. Let's just have fun and let me show you some really cool items. Let me know in the comments down below after you watch this video which of these items that you would want. Okay, the, my first item up is perfect for the upcoming holiday season. Actually, it's perfect for year round. I got some of these because um, you're actually going to see these featured in my upcoming tablescape this coming Friday for Thanksgiving, and I love them. Okay, so they are a taper candle that is battery operated. But what I'm really loving about them is that they have a real wax feel and they come with a remote control. I think these would be great for like Christmas, putting them out. And the best part is that like, say you have to put them up on a mantle or something like that, and it's kind of a pain to like keep turning them on and off. You have a remote, you just click it, boom, on and off. They look so realistic. So all of these items will be listed down below and they did come from Amazon. Loving this one. It takes two AAA batteries and you're ready to go. Okay, next up, I love these. It is a set of three apothecary jars. Third one's down here. And of course it has candy corn in it because I love candy corn. I've already started playing with this one. But the best part about these, these always make me nervous, especially to put candy in when other people are coming over because, oh my goodness, what if it's a little kid and they're gonna like lift the lid and break it? These are acrylic. They look so nice so pretty like glass, but they're actually acrylic. Am I gonna start getting my QVC voice? <laughs> the Home Shopping Network. I'm trying not to. <laughs> but they really are like a really good thing to have if you do have kids around that they're not breakable. I gotta show you guys a little trick. This is just a fun little trick. Okay, this jar was full, but I love candy corn so much. But let me give you a little trick. So say you wanna put these out just like Oh, like maybe, you know, on a buffet or something at Christmas time with cute little candies in it, but you don't have enough candy to fill the jar. So look, this actually has a glass in the middle of it. So then that way it's just going around. When I remove this glass, look how what low the candy ends up going. And it was full, but I ate all those. But anyway, so that's a fun little trick. So if you ever want to make it appear like you have more candy in your jar than you actually do, put a glass down in there and it works perfect. These would be great also like in a bathroom if you wanna put you know, your soaps and that kind of thing in it, really pretty around your tub, even on your counter. I'm so excited about these and now I no longer have to worry about like my grandkids or my nieces and nephews popping that lid on. You don't know how many of these I've got that have been broken, so. Great suggestion, I highly recommend these. Might be my number one out of this whole thing. I don't know, I have a lot of things I really like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, now would be a great time to do so and hit that thumbs up, it really helps my channel out. Okay, so this next item is purely, purely decorative and for fun, but such a good deal, I had to share it with you. So every year at Christmas time, I put my stockings out for my entire family. Well, each year lately, my family has been growing and I no longer can get the stockings that I had before. So now I'm minus one. So I was like, okay, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna get new stockings. I happened to see these over on Pinterest and I fell in love. Look how adorable these are. They're just a really nice, thick quality. You can get ones longer than this. I actually, um, there's two different sizes. I think there's 14 inches and 18 inches. I got the 14 inches because of where it hangs for my fireplace. But even if you don't have a fireplace, these would be adorable, like hanging on like a little ladder or something like that. And then as you saw there in the Pinterest picture, they bought these cute little luggage tags and then you never have to like worry. You can just keep adding to people and you can do their little name inside of there. And so I went ahead and I bought a, I think I bought a set of 12. 
I think they come in packages of six. So I think I bought two packages of six. I'll always have them. I can even include my dogs and they can have a stocking if I wanted to. But really good deal, really nice quality. I know I've said that already, but sometimes you get these and they're just not very good, but it's got like t good tightness to it where you want it to hold up if you're going to put something in that stocking actually and not just for decorative looks. So I just feel like this is a really fun way to dress it up for Christmas this year. Okay, next up, this might seem really random, like really random. So these are adorable and would make really cute gifts and they're perfect for styling your coffee table or shelves. They're these nice little creamy, kind of off-white colored vases. They come in a set of three and they're all three different shaped. So they're just like the perfect little style. They do also come with a little bit of jute string if you wanted to tie that around the top part and give it like a rustic farmhouse look. But if you want it to be more modern, you can leave that off. Let's go downstairs and style these on my coffee table or in my bathroom, I was thinking about that on my shelf. And let me show you how cute these are for the price. I think I could think of like a ton of different ways to style these. Look how easy and cute that is. You could also put like greenery in with that. Um, let's go put them on my bathroom shelves. Okay, yep, I am completely sold on these. I am so excited to have these. These are gonna be a great addition to almost anywhere that I wanna decorate. This next one, I want you to run, not walk, to go get these. <laughs> I never see these in the store. I found them on Amazon. They come in packs of two, so you technically get four and they are like a cord holder and they are so neat. They're command hooks and these are fantastic to hold your cords out of the way. Let me show you how I'm gonna use mine on my KitchenAid mixer for that cord that I usually always have all wrapped around. This is exactly what I was needing in order to have that nice, neat appearance. Let's go check it out. Okay, I always have my cord just wrapped around it like this for when I put it away and then it's such a pain, so. Get that off there. And then let's take one of these and let's hook it like right here. So awesome. Look how it's like keeping it out of the way. This thing is handy. I really like it. Now we don't have to like wrap it around. Mm -hmm. I like that. Thanks. A lot. I like it a lot. This one, you guys actually was commenting on back a few videos ago when I was hanging pictures on the wall. And this is a laser level that I use. It's awesome, I love this thing. You stick it on the wall and then it helps guide you to make sure that you're like getting your picture straight across. I've been using one of these for years. This is great for any man, woman, anyone, hanging home decor, doing any kind of home project. This goes hand in hand with my actual next product that I'm going to suggest. Okay, and to go along with our laser level, these are awesome. This is a wall gallery of nine different frames that you can get off of Amazon, and they're actually really good quality. What I like about them is they are lightweight, so that makes it easy to hang. They come super nicely packaged, so that all the corners are protected. It's got plastic on all the way around, but then inside, even like on, the plastic that's there, you have to take that out and it's covered there also to keep them safe and so they don't get scratched up. These are really awesome. These are 12 by 12 and then inside the mat is 8 by 8 and it comes with all different um, florals in the black and white. So if you wanted to do a gallery wall and you don't want to like print off your own pictures, you could totally use what's in here. It would look great. But this is just a really great suggestion if you're looking for something to hang on your wall or if you have a bigger space and you kind of need to fill it up. A gallery wall is a great option and these are really inexpensive but a lot of bang for your buck. And sometimes you can get them and they can have really cheap corners. But all of these have been so nice. I lucked out, I got a good set. So I hope if you guys ordered that you do also. I actually love these. If you follow me over on Instagram, you know why my voice sounds so hoarse. <laughs> I got sick a couple weeks ago and then after that my voice has never been the same, so hopefully it goes back soon. But if you would like more behind the scenes, follow me along over there. This next product won me over last Christmas. It's a wireless remote outlet. It comes with five in the pack and a remote that can do all five of them at one time. 
the best part about it is you don't even have to be pointing at it in order for it to work. You can just be in the same room. So I'm not even pointing at it on and off. This is so awesome for your Christmas decor. Say you have garland like across your mantle or coming up your stairs, anything like that. Christmas tree. You can plug them all into one of these wireless remote outlets and use this one remote to go around and turn the stuff on and off. It's totally worth it. It made my life so easy because I, you know, like when I would get up and I'd want to turn on all my Christmas stuff, I would just go around and I would turn my Christmas stuff on and then when I would go to bed, I would click it off. Done. <laughs> Highly worth it. Okay, these next three items, actually I'm just gonna combine them and they're gonna be one of the 10 because they kinda all go together. So these are super nice storage jars that you can get over on Amazon. They're a set of five and they're all different sizes and they have these really nice wood tops. They have nice good suction. The best part about it is here you have it. They have the most amazing labels. So say you don't have a Cricut or something like that this is 157 labels that you can buy to put on. It's in this super cute font. I am blown away by some of the stuff that's in here, like self-rising flour, brown rice, rolled oats, breadcrumbs, cocoa powder, grits, cereal, dried fruits. I mean, there's 157 of these. You can pretty much find anything you need. It even has gluten-free items. So you got these really cute storage jars. You got your cute label. Then for your brown sugar or crackers or anything like that, I want you to get one of these little stone bears. These are so awesome. You soak this in water for 20 minutes. It's made out of terracotta. And then all you do is stick that in with your brown sugar and your brown sugar is going to stay super moist. I think three to six months is how long it normally lasts if I remember right. So how cute is that? Let me show you what it looks like. Okay, here they are. And when they arrive, you do have to put the little, if I can do this one handed, you do have to put the little silicone piece on yourself. So don't be surprised when you have to do that, but they go on super easy. I love the little labels. Those are awesome. I cannot believe the choices. They even had couscous. I was super excited. And then of course we have our little brown bear in there keeping our brown sugar nice and moist for like six months. One more thing on a side note with these, a lot of times I will cut off the directions for things like this and then hook it to the bottom. As long as it's not big and bulky, it'll set fine. And then say like my pasta, if I just need to remember, sometimes I'll cut it off and I'll just add it down in there with it. And then that way I always have the directions when I put them in jars like this. I highly recommend these. These are awesome. Last on our list, but no way is it least, is the Oceder Spin Mop. Where, where has this been my whole life? I'm 47 years old, and why have I not had one of these? I've used all kinds of mops throughout all the years. Steam mops, my Bona mop, I do like that one. But give yourself the test. This is what I do. I have it sitting back over there. I just got done mopping my floors. Okay. Mop your floors, and then a little while later after it's all dry, go get a paper towel, get it a little damp, and wipe your floor, and tell me if anything comes up on it. Because when I was like mopping my floor before with my Bona Mop, I would still get dirt, and it was like, ew, okay, so am I just like moving the dirt all around? This thing is awesome. I love how it spins the water out. I can get my floors clean with just warm water, 99% of bacteria because of the microfiber cloths that it's cleaned with. They're washable. You can, um, they're easily replaced. This, this is something I highly, highly recommend and had no idea. And I'm really sad that I'm just now this age and my floors just now finally feel really clean. Put this on your wish list for Christmas, your birthday, or splurge and get yourself one if you want to have your floors nice and clean. I am so completely blown away with how dirty the water was after I did my floors compared to when I would do them with my other mop. Now I can just pop this off. Look how dirty this is. I am amazed pop this off and go throw this in the washing machine and it'll be all set to go for next time. It also has an extendable handle. So like this is it on the ground so you don't have to like bend over so far. I crack myself up because I am a person who has a tendency to bend over 
really far when they don't even need to. So I've been trying to like practice, like you don't need to bend over so far while you're mopping. <laughs> but it does and then it retracts down and makes it small so that's nice also I hope you guys enjoyed today's video it was so fun sharing with you all these fun items that I really enjoy I hope you found it helpful we'll see you guys in the next video bye bye